Hi, my name is Kiraz, and I'm a software engineering manager on Microsoft Clarity. Clarity cares deeply about maintaining user privacy, and in this video, we will cover a few features to help you maintain the privacy of your site visitors. To stop Clarity from tracking certain IP addresses, add those addresses to a block list. Doing so prevents any recordings, heat maps, or metrics from being tracked for sessions for those IPs. This ensures that data associated with internal IP addresses is not included in the data collected from your website's visitors. Navigate to Clarity Settings, select Block IP Address, and type in your IP address to be blocked. It will take effect immediately. To mask the content that Clarity receives from your website, you can leverage our masking options. Navigate to Clarity Settings, select Masking. From there, you can choose from our presets or customize specific HTML elements. We offer three preset levels. Relaxed mode only masks input fields. Balanced mode masks input fields, dropdowns, and certain text. Strict mode masks all content on your website. To mask specific fields, click Add Elements at the bottom of this masking settings. Enter the CSS selector and click Confirm. You may also mask specific fields by editing your HTML. Simply add the attribute data-clarity-mask with the value true to an HTML element in your DOM. That node and its children's contents are masked. Keep in mind that this overrides anything set on the Clarity website. Clarity's cookie customization settings can be helpful tools as you ensure your compliance with all applicable laws. By default, Clarity's tracking code is placed in the HTML header of your site. It loads immediately, potentially, before your user indicates whether they consent to your use of cookies. To instruct Clarity not to place a cookie until you obtain user consent, update your settings by navigating to Setup. Turn off the cookies. Then, navigate to your website code. Modify the JavaScript that listens for the event indicating whether the visitor consented to cookies by adding window.clarity with the first argument consent. You can also erase Clarity's cookies and start a new session on the user's machine using window.clarity, the first argument consent, and second argument false. You can verify that Clarity isn't collecting cookies. To do that, first clear cookies for your website. Navigate back to your website, then decline to give cookie consent. Ensure Clarity is executing. To do that, check for the slash collect calls in the network tab in the DevTools. Then, check your browser cookies and observe that there is no entry for underscore CLCK or underscore CLSK. Please remember, per the Clarity terms of use, Clarity may not be used on sites with sensitive, financial, health, or government-related information. If your site is in these industries, you will be required to accept an additional attestation during the sign-up process stating that you are using Clarity for your website in compliance with local laws and regulations. Thank you for watching this video and using Clarity in a privacy compliant way. Check out some of our other videos next.